Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Ashton. If you're not new, thanks for coming back. So I thought I would do another like week in my life because it's currently half term um, for me at the moment. So I'm actually going back home today and Erin's coming with me because she was going to end up being here on her own and we had a bit of an incident the other week, which I'm sure I'll tell you at some point, but um, didn't really want to leave her and please excuse my like fake tan I've put on my face. Like it's it always grips to here, which is not ideal but when i've got makeup on it doesn't look so bad but i just couldn't be bothered to put it on um but yeah today is monday i actually filmed my 10,000 calorie challenge on saturday oh my god i actually don't know how i did that like that was horrible <laughs> um and yesterday i literally couldn't do anything because i was just like so tired and stuff and i think it's just generally from eating so much food i was just there like oh like all day so that was not fun um but today i'm feeling a bit better it's actually gone up today so if you haven't seen my 10,000 calorie challenge please go check it out um but yeah so i'm just currently packing and tidying my room at the moment and then we should get on the road literally had shit traffic um it's like normally takes me like one hour 15 to get here and like it's taken us two hours but it would be more but it's only because my dad managed to sort us out so don't go home on a bike holiday weekend You'll regret it. <laughs> <laughs> it's me fine. Oh, so fine. He's a new madness. He won't be mine. Didn't I know how we got to leave a so we are back at mine now. We've been here for quite a while now, but just been busy saying hi to my parents. And I forgot about my parcel. Look at it. Look at it, look at it. This is, um, I ordered a while ago some Misfits protein bars because I have the protein powder and I honestly love it. Like I would recommend, not sponsored, just it's really good for a plant-based one. Um, but I accidentally ordered it to here instead of my house in Guildford. So I ordered, I spent 54 pounds on protein bars, but, but it is worthwhile because there's 48 protein bars, which roughly works out like one pound 12 per protein bar. So it's actually a better deal than you think. Look! So I've got a box of like the variety box. I haven't tried all the flavors, so I want to see what I like. I then got the chocolate caramel because I like this one, especially if you heat it up in the microwave. And I got another variety box to test it out. And then I got this one, which I haven't tried, but everyone everyone raves about it. So I've got this try, so I'll let you know if it's any good. But I'm so excited. Sorry, I forgot to film yesterday because I went out for drinks with my friend Ella and Kaylee and Erin and then we ended up going back to Tom's house and having some drinks and stuff um, in his garden and I didn't really want to film if I'm being honest. So yeah, so that was yesterday. But today I had work this morning. It's like two, I think. And then we are going to the beach because it's honestly gorgeous. Gorgeous weather, whoa. That's got a bit pale. It's absolutely gorgeous today. Look at Maxie. Maxie, is it nice and hot? Maxie, why do you look so sad? Oh, bless you. Bless you. No, oh, bless. You got so many lumps and bumps. Oh. I'm gonna lie, yesterday I literally felt so much pain just from the 10,000 calorie challenge. Like, it's really affected me like don't do it i thought it was all i thought on sunday like i was all right a bit tired but i now like can really 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 feel it and i feel bloated and disgusting and like really struggling so yeah mm, would not recommend say hi mum <laughs> 
we've got our drinks. We're at the beach now and I got a sunset was it? Pineapple. pineapple sunset. Pineapple sunset was pineapple, mango and papaya. And what did you get? I got an iced oat milk latte with salted caramel. Mm. There we go. I haven't tried it yet. <laughs> oh. I'm mixing. I've got to mix it. Oh, I love it when you have to like mix it though. Oh, like, that. oh, that's, really that's really satisfying. Mum, what did you get? A boring decaf tea. Ah, <laughs> oh, is it not a bit too hot for that? And well, no, you're supposed to drink know. hot when it's hot because yeah. it cools you down. down. What? Hot yeah. when it's hot? Yeah, because yeah. it makes you like cold drinks. Don't it's a thing. Cool you down, yeah. Apparently. I've never heard of that before. That's weird. Yeah. Oh, gonna... that's so good. Is it? Oh. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I enjoy the sun now. I get my Yeah. Round two. <laughs> Sorry, it is Wednesday. We haven't filmed very much. I filmed a little bit of us in a coffee shop, but we'd just been a bit awkward. <laughs> But we went to Lido's. Lido's. Lido. We went into Lido's and found like their own version of um, Little Moons. They had like mango and coconut as well. But we wanted to try chocolate and vanilla, so we thought we'd try them on here for you. What in here as well? Yeah. Okay. Right, which one do you want to do first? Chocolate, maybe. Or do you think chocolate might be a bit overpowering for vanilla? Drink vanilla first. Okay. This is one we have to wait like <laughs> ages. I, I, I hope they're not. I reckon they're quite soft. They were literally like two ninety nine as well. So. I would try them. Oh, they're big. They're like what flatter. That? That's what it is. Mm. Oh. To be fair though, I think it's like because little they're they're mo mo mocky, mochi, mo mochi, mo mochi, mochi. Like Little Moons is just the brand, so technically it's not like their version of Little Moons. Like it's oh, cold on my bones. Oh, sorry, sorry. Okay, they feel a little bit hard. You might need to wait a little bit. We'll see you. In five. Now back. Um, we did have a slight intermission and went to fill up some petrol, so now we're actually parked outside my house. So let's okay. try this. Okay. Ooh, it's, it's really gooey. This is the vanilla ah. ones. Oh, it's sticky. Oh. Come on. <laughs> the ice cream's nice. Mmm. It's just so gooey. I quite like it, mm. gooey. It's not very good. sticky on your fingers. Right. Mm. I like it gooey. The ice cream's like proper like mm. vanilla ice cream. Like where it's got like the black little specks. No, <laughs> yeah, I mean, though. No. Okay. <laughs> okay, cheers. Mm. Mm. Very chocolatey. That's really... I really like that though. Mmm. 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 That's proper chocolate ice cream. Yeah. But it doesn't Ooh. taste gooey. It just tastes like it's like rich, like a fudge cake or something. Mmm. 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 Let's turn to a food channel. I ain't complaining. No. I do very you. well out of all of your You food do, food. actually. Mm. I'm not going to be able to take them back. No. Oh, we're going to have to eat them. Oh, what oh, a pity. No. Okay, guys, so it is Thursday today. Excuse what I look like. Um, I have my PJs on. It's like half one. I have my PJs on. I haven't properly washed my face. I've probably got makeup on my face. I just wanted to show it's the reality of adulting. We're weeding! <laughs> Yay! You're actually doing a pretty good job though. Literally. Yay, look! This is actually pretty good. We've done it. I'm quite happy with this. We've done it. This is okay, probably this. kind of boring, but this is what happens when you move out and all winter the weeds grow and you have no garden currently. How's it going, Ash? Look at that part. And that one. Just getting there. A lot better than it was. <laughs> oh, I look so pale. You do. <laughs> then again, I'm burnt like. Yeah, she got really burnt oh. the other day. But it'll turn to tan. It will. It'll go brown. It's exactly. Fine. So exactly. we've we've been to the gym. Yeah, we have. Did arm um, do it? Oh, 
She look popping. at them guns! She Ooh. popping! <laughs> they look good! She's got her guns. Yeah, and I'm now make him dinner. you're making dinner. I'm not making dinner yet. Well, I am. I'm making a... Well, it's not full English. I've got cauliflower hash browns, which are actually really good before you judge. Three fake meat Richmond sausages, some mushroom, sourdough, and an egg. So I thought that's basically a full English apart from the bacon. And I don't like beans. Yeah. So I feel that's right, but that's that's what we're making. I need to stop waving my knife. <laughs> I know, that's very <laughs> Guys, it's Thursday now, and this sounds really boring. It's pouring a towel, but we just took all of the weeds to the tip. It sounds and like you've just taken all the weed. Oh yes, no, 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 all like the, not all the garden waste, like God. garden waste. <laughs> no, no, imagine if we just had a car full of weed, lol. Maybe that was the smell. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. But um, yeah, we took it, and we're quite proud of ourselves because we have adulted properly today. Woo. So yeah, I know it's kind of boring, but um, highlight of our week. Woo! Did it! Did it! Did it! Yay! So guys, Erin and I went to the shop quickly because basically, <laughs> poke the head out, because <laughs> basically, um, Tom and I's anniversary is on the 22nd of June. It is our two year anniversary and um, we're just going to go out for a meal because I'm at uni that day. Um, and we decided to go to the Ivy in Guildford, which is obviously like a nice restaurant. Like they literally have a dress code saying like you have to dress smart. So I thought I would treat myself and get a nice dress to wear because I don't really have a dress to wear. Um, so we went to Zara because I've been looking on the website um, for some dresses and the dress I actually wanted, like the green swirly one, they didn't have, which I kind of thought so because like everyone wants that dress at the moment. So I thought I would get some bits and just try them on here because I'm literally like a five minute walk from Zara. So I'm just going to show you what I got. The first dress I got was this one. I got it in two sizes. I got it in a small and medium because we're not really sure what size I'm going to be. This is when I'm large and then I'm like, oh great, I didn't get a large. <laughs> but yeah, and it's got like little flowers on, which I think is really cute. But I just really like the sort of satiny like flowy ones because as well you can kind of hide if you've got a bit of a food baby <laughs> we don't like anything too tight so i got that in um two sizes so i'll try that on for you in a second also got a similar dress which kind of looks like lingerie that, that's what erin said that looks like this you can't really tell i'm not i'm a bit confused how this one goes on because it has um it's satiny but it's got like a bit of lace i think that's goes at the, that the front or the back well, that's the front. So that's oh, so the lace is oh. at the front. Yeah. That's the front. Yeah, the lace goes at the front. And then... Lace peaked out over it. They like crosses. I might need some help. Getting <laughs> into these dresses, I'm going to get confused. So I think that's in a size small, because I only have a small, so that might not fit me, because I feel like I would be a medium normally. But yeah, and then I also got this, which is actually from Primark, which is this blazer. I got it in a size 16, so it's like oversized. And it's in this like sage green, and I've wanted one like this from Motel Rocks for ages, ages, but they've been sold out. And this was only 15 quid, so a lot cheaper. So I'm quite happy with this. I'm still not 100% whether I'll keep it. I'm kind of going to see how it looks with the dresses because I'm not supposed to be spending money at the moment. But I really wanted it, so we're going to see. So I will try them on and show you what they look like. So this is the first dress. It's a little bit short, I'm not going to lie. I went up the stairs. I did good, and I've also put my character shoes on because they're the only heels I have. Um, I don't know, I'm not a huge fan of this, I don't think. It's just like the way it just, I don't like this bit. I feel like if it was just a plain one, and I, and I just feel like it's far too short. I think the length is nice. Yeah, but it just depends what, like, what happens when you sit down. Like my ass is on show. Well, I don't know. I feel like it's potential. I feel like if it didn't have this, I'd like it more. Yeah. I'm just a bit like, what's the reason? Why is that there? Because <laughs> my arse, my arse cheek ends there. Yeah. I just feel like... It doesn't really sit right. No. Like, I always need, like, more, like... I'm just... I'm gonna think I'm going to send them back. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Try it with the blazer. Let's mm -hmm. try with the blazer along. Because, like, leaning over, arse is coming out. Yeah. <sighs> Girl problems. Well, that's nice. Yeah, but it's like that's the same. Yeah. But the blazer's longer than the dress. <laughs> it's a good look, though. I like it. Um, 
So yeah, this was my really successful haul. Um, I hope you enjoyed. I will be sending it all back. Like, I was not going to vlog this at all because I've already got a lot of footage and, like, I can't be bothered because I'm just going into town. But who does she think she is? Like, I am sorry. But who does she think she is? Why do I feel like I look like such a boss? Me, myself. My hair's just greasy, but I, like, put gel in it. So I put it back and then these sunglasses just... I feel so extra with them on. And I'm still like indecisive about this jacket, so. I don't tell anyone, but I'm basically, I've still got the tags on, so I'm gonna wear it out today, see what the vibe is like. I just can't 100% tell um, and see what happens. But yeah, I'm just gonna go return the other dresses today. That's basically why I'm going into town. So yeah. Hi guys, sorry, it's actually Sunday evening now. Sorry to have a bit of an abrupt end, but I didn't really film this weekend. It's been a little bit of an emotional whirlwind this weekend, but we're all good now. I see ya. We're all good. Fresh as a daisy. Thank you for your positive eyes. I hope everyone had a good weekend. If you did have a little bit of an emotional weekend, like me, just remember Monday is a brilliant day because Monday gives you the opportunity to have a fresh start. Think more positive. Do what you have to do, whether that's write three things that you're grateful for today whether that's stretching or going to the gym or whether that's sitting on your sofa watching tv and eating a lot of ice cream do what makes you feel happy but yeah i hope you had a good week thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you next time bye